Welcome to Seven Trumpets of Prepper. And guys, um, on this beautiful, bright, sunny, cold morning, um, heading to a customer to do a um, link up on their Snyder units for lithium power um, and do some stuff like that out in the field today. And as I'm driving down the road, uh, I was just thinking I wanted to share with you that if you haven't looked it up, there is apparently in China, they're starting to make artificial wombs to um, pretty much grow human embryos and produce people. And um, this is stuff straight out of the matrix. Like, you know, <laughs> I tell you what, as if it ain't bad enough some days that thought goes through your mind, some of the stuff that you experience. Like, am I dealing with NPCs? Is this, is this a, uh, you know, like uh, a projection? Am I living in a uh, created reality, you know, that's just like something out of the matrix, you know, just because of some of the stuff that goes on in life. This here is 110% out of the pages of the matrix. Um, crazy stuff. And um, so anyway, apparently over in China, they're working on it so that AI can um, produce human beings in um, embryo tanks and stuff like that. Pretty much something like right out of that movie Replicants. If you've never seen that movie Replicants that has Keanu Reeves in it. Um, I mean, like this is pretty much legit now. And so, I, I mean, one of the first thoughts actually though that goes through my mind with this, like not to mention that like it's demonic, not to mention that it's like goes right down the line with Neuralink, which the more I think about my Tesla truck and the more that I know it's associated with Elon Musk and the more that this whole Neuralink thing and everything, I'm really starting to rethink buying it. I might actually just get an electric truck somewhere else the more I'm considering upon this matter and just cancel my reservation. It's not like I'm going to get it anyway. It's been two years and they still haven't produced it. Um, but um, the more I think about all this stuff, like the more it just walks hand in hand together. I mean, like if they produce, imagine, <laughs> if, imagine if you will for just a minute, um, human beings produced that never really had a mother or father that were DNA sequenced and um, AI pretty much put this thing together. I don't even know what we're dealing with on that back end, on the back end of that. I don't. And I'm just saying that is some really freaking creepy stuff. And folks, <clears throat> on a spiritual side of things, if you look at Daniel's vision, uh, or, or you know the uh, in the book of Daniel, you know where you see Nebuchadnezzar uh, and all these things, and the statue and the stone that was cut without hands, spoke the statue, and you see all this stuff, and you, and you have the gold and the bronze, and um, oh my goodness, it, 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 I'm sorry, folks, I'm up way early this morning, and my baby girl kept me up all night. I bless her heart; she's finally starting to drift off to sleep this morning. But um, the toes of iron and clay mixed together, okay, as you get on down uh, on the, the statue, that is the last portion of that vision before the, the stone cut without hands smote that and the kingdom of Yah was set up. And we're seeing this taking place before our very eyes. And as of the days of Noah, so is the coming of the Son of Man, and so shall it be the coming of the Son of Man. And I'm just saying, like, I keep hitting this lightly. I feel like it's a reoccurring theme, and I'm going to continue to hit on it on this channel because all the scoffers and the mockers and the false pastors and the false teachers and the false prophets and the false shepherds that keep saying, oh, it's not the last days. Oh, we're not in the last days yet. Oh, it's not the end of days. Blah, blah, blah. Hello. Here it is. Not to mention Revelation 18, like I said the other day with the pharmaceutical drug sorcery. So, guys, I don't want to hold you this up long. I'm going to work today. Hopefully make a paycheck. Um, and uh, But I just want to point that out, that that's really messed up. And if you haven't seen, because, I mean, the problem with this stuff, you know, the things that I share on this channel, is I could get on here every day and talk about something. I really could. Um, I'm a very busy person, and social media is just, I, I try to take it small doses anymore. Um, but, like, as far as it goes with stuff like this, like, it's not like you're going to turn on the news today. Um, the stuff that will bleed your brain out and just watching it and melt your brain down. It's not like you're going to watch that on the news and hear about this stuff, okay? And so I just try to forward this information along and I'll try to put some information video description too when I get around to this and uh, maybe get home tonight off the job site. But uh, love everybody out there. 
guys, stay vigilant because we are living in some crazy times, and it's it's all winding up. It's all winding up, and this stuff they're doing over in China. If you think that you know every anything that starts somewhere else always spreads everywhere else. I'm just saying, okay. So, anyways, guys, always until we see you again here, Seven Trumpets Trevor Channel. Hope most high y'all Baruch can keep you, make his face shine upon you, show you favor, and give you shalom, my friends. In Yahushua name.